Hey you guys, oh, what's up? It's your girl Tash, welcome back to my channel. Hey girl, hey. I forgot to say that in my last two videos, I think. Hey girl, hey. All right, so for today's video, if you guys didn't notice, what I'm gonna be doing is hauling for you the makeup brushes that I just purchased off of Amazon. Now, two of these brands, well, it's actually the same brand, two of these sets are actually from a brand that I know and love and have used myself, and they are very high quality, professional grade brushes, and I love them. I think that they are at a very affordable price, and I just really wanted to share them with you. A lot of you have been asking me about makeup brushes, and I think that it is important, aside from all of the inexpensive makeup that I've been sharing with you, to let you know that in my opinion, your tools really truly do count. So if you are having a lot of issues with cheaper eyeshadows, uh, cheaper foundations, any of the cheaper inexpensive makeup that you have been playing with recently, know that the quality of your tools do count. So if you are curious to see what kind of makeup brushes that I just purchased and that I am going to add to my collection, then just keep watching. All right, you guys, please do not forget to vote in the poll that I am gonna put right up here for you guys. Um, if you guys want to see my current uh, brush collection, the brushes that I'm going to declutter, and also my favorite brushes prior to purchasing these again. Because I know that a couple of you have messaged me and asked me, and I just think, you know, if we can do it all in one video, it would be very helpful to others if you guys do, in fact, want to say that. So again, I will leave the poll up in the iCards for you. Let's go ahead and get into these. So all three of these sets were purchased from Amazon, and we are Amazon Prime members, so you also get the Amazon prime member price as well as the really quick shipping like it literally took a day for these to get to me so the first set is from the brand called just up beauty and um they come in a box like this it is a slider box this is one of the 15 piece sets Hold on just a second. Okay, this is one of the individual uh, brush sets. It includes 15 pieces, and I got mine in black and silver. So here is the Unicarton. I think these guys do a fabulous job. Yes, they are a company based out of China um, that manufactures these, but they do an amazing job on makeup brushes. So once you pull off your Unicarton, it is going to come like this. You're going to remove this. You do get a very a nice quality little instruction booklet. It tells you about the company, um, what they stand behind. It tells you a little bit about your makeup brushes, how to care for your brushes, because you are getting natural hair brushes as well as synthetic brushes. So they do have them all individually packaged like this. And... I'm going to go ahead and take them all out of the packages for you, and I'm going to quickly run through what kind of brushes you get in your 15-piece eye kit. All right, you guys, so now we're going to go through the 15 pieces that you get in depth. Um, so starting off, I just want to also mention that this company does give you a six-month quality assurance protection. So if you're blending away with the brush and I don't know, the handle bust off, you can contact them or the Amazon seller right away and Jessup will take care of you and provide you and with and replace your brush or brushes. So um, the other thing that I do want to mention is when you do get new brushes, it doesn't matter if you bought them from Sigma, Mac, um, they came in a package from Real Techniques, you really should wash your new brushes because before you got that item, you have no idea whose hands touched it. Girl, and people do some nasty stuff. So make sure you are, you know, keeping it clean and washing your brushes because you're gonna put those on your face and near your eye. It's just super important. Okay, first thing is first, you guys. We are getting the number 221 Luxe Soft Crease Brush. And that is what it looks like. It does tell you on the um, brush what it is. And basically, you guys, see, they're very soft, very nice quality. I love this brand. Um, even though it says what it is on the brush, you know, don't be afraid to use your brushes for how you see fit. That's the beauty of makeup and makeup brushes is that they're very versatile. And if you ever have any question, you can always refer back to the Amazon page where you purchase these from. 
and there's actually a page on there and it has all the brushes listed and it tells you what they're used for so that is really really helpful especially those of you my girls hey girls that are just getting started with eye makeup and whatnot so we got you covered the next one is the 222 Lux all over shader and this is what she looks like I don't know why I call things she and he. <laughs> the next one is the number 228 Lux Crease Brush. You're going to use this to blend out shadows and whatnot. Really do some detail work there. You guys, I know it is hard to see these. I do apologize. I'm going to try holding them back. Maybe that'll help. The next one is the 317 Wing Liner Brush. Very, very nice. This one is the 142 Concealer Buffer. Just want to also point out that after looking at these and comparing them to the Zoeva brushes that I was looking at, yes girl, I was going to treat myself. <laughs> I really feel like these are dead on dupes. That's just my opinion. Um, okay, this set, I mean, <laughs> is a dupe for Sigma in my opinion. Um, the other set that I have in here to me is a dupe for Zoeva. Okay, number 322 is the Brow Liner Brush. You guys, don't mind my hands. They are super dry. They are cracking this year, and I've been doing uh, Vaseline treatments and stuff on them, and also using my Luxme uh, not a lot of Camelt Bomb. That stuff is amazing. Okay, the next one is the number 227 Lux Soft Definer Brush. Here we have the 231 Lux Petite Crease Brush. That's what the head of it looks like. The 312 Detail Liner Brush. Move it up here so you guys can see. Also, 223 Petite Eye Blender. The 237 Detail Shader. 234 Luxe Smoky Shader. And then 230 Lux Pencil. 223 Cream Shader. 233, excuse me. These are really, really soft, you guys. Ugh. And then 226, the Smudger Brush. So that is all 15 pieces that you get in this kit right here. I'm sticking them back in this box because I actually have to go wash these after. All right, so this next set, you may recognize if you watch Juicy Jazz. I talk about her a lot on my channel. She's one of my favorite YouTubers. I apologize for the crinkle sound. ASMR. <laughs> anyway, so she highly recommends this one. I think the company name is Fayon, I think. But it comes in this really nice pouch here. And you open it up, and it has a set of, I can't remember how many. <laughs> I've actually had these sitting here for quite a few days. The inside of the pouch is pink, which I love. You guys know I love me some pink. And then it also has this really nice secondary zippered compartment in here. So I cannot wait to use this for my makeup. It is really nice. So in the bag, you also get a letter from the company that talks to you about how to care for your brushes, um, how to care for your pouch. This is a washable pouch. And then, so here's their company name and emblem. And then their little zipper pull. Really nice pouch, especially for the price you're paying for this. I believe this set was under 20. Again, everything will be linked down below. I don't want to provide you guys with the wrong information. So... Oh, this one's so nice. So actually, instead of, I mean, I'm going to show you guys a few of these because I want you to see how they come and whatnot, but I'm actually going to show you this because this has all of the brushes that you are getting in the kit. It tells you about the brushes. It tells you what you can use them for. And then there's more information down here about how to clean your brushes. So this is really cool. So I'm just gonna read off the top. We have the large powder brush. We have a number two large powder brush. Number three stippling a foundation brush. We have the number four angled cream cheek brush for blush and contour. Number five shape brush. 
Number six, concealer buffer. A number 13, or excuse me, number seven, angled brow line brush. A number eight, angled contour brush. A number nine, petite eye blending brush. Number 10, angled eyeliner. A number 11, Lux Soft Eye Blending, a number 12, Lux Eyeshadow Brush, a number 13, Lux Soft Definer, a number 14, Lux Petite Crease Brush, and then the number 15, Economically Shaped Eyeliner Brush. This is really nice, especially, you know, for those that are um, beginners in makeup and, or just, you know, re-updating your skills, if you will. <laughs> All right, guys, so here's how it comes double packaged. All right, so your larger brushes are going to come packaged in plastic here and then with this netting around it to secure, I mean, you know, and really keep your brush shape. I don't know what's wrong with my talking today. This is so luxe and so soft. Oh, my goodness. I wish you guys could reach through the screen and touch it. It's so nice. All right, so here's one of them. It does have the name on it, unfortunately, guys. I don't see the numbers on these. So that's kind of a bummer, but you know, keep your guide. She's re it's really going to help you out. You're just going to match it up right here. So this is the number two large powder brush. You see? So keep your guide if you're a beginner. This is really going to help you out. And if you have questions, honey, I will do my best to help you. All right, so I'm gonna go off camera and take all of the plastic off of these. I will quickly show you a couple of these brushes and then I'm gonna get into the next one because that one's even larger and we'll be right back. All right, you guys, so I got everything unpackaged from that brand. So I'm gonna just show you a couple of these. It's the large stippling brush. You guys, I have, I mean, those brushes from Dress Up were soft, but oh my goodness. <laughs> These are even softer. I mean, they just feel so luxurious. And again, I want to say this set was like 20 bucks or under. Girl. Okay, let me quit fantasizing and like, because it's just so soft. I just want to, you know. Anywho, so here is the large powder brush. Lar or This is the angled blush contour brush. And then... I think this might be a highlighter brush. I mean, it looks like you could use this for highlighting or um, maybe concealer. You can use them for whatever you want. So be creative with your brushes. All right, so here are all of the eye. <laughs> here are all the eye brushes that you get with this set again. I'm trying to hold them all up. So you get 15 pieces total. Again, these are really nice. I kept them black and silver. There you go. Very, very, very nice quality. Like, you guys, I used to spend the money on um, high-end brushes and whatnot. And I started finding that you don't have to spend $200 on a brush set to get good makeup. So, um, do I like high-end brushes? Of course I do. <laughs> I mean, that's like asking me if I like high-end makeup. Of course I do. <laughs> but you don't have to spend that much money. So that is why I'm here to help you guys. And I'm just putting this back in my pouch because, again, I need to clean these. All right, guys. So this is the one I'm extra, extra excited about. And FYI, I just want to put a disclaimer out there. You guys do not need all of these brushes, especially if you're a beginner or you're somebody who only wears makeup on special occasions, but you're just getting into it. Anything like that. You don't need all of these. The amount of brushes I have is ridiculous. But basically, I got, I've always had a lot of brushes, but I got even more when I got on YouTube because what I do is I rotate them out um, and I just love makeup brushes. <laughs> but you really don't need all of these. If you are confused on what you need, girl, get at me down in the comment section and I will help you out. So again, the Just Up brand comes in a unicarton like so. And then when you get your package, it's going to be like this. This is the Just Up 25-piece uh, Rose and Carmen, Rose, Carmen, and Silver set. So again, you're going to get the same thing right here that tells you how to care for it, it tells you some information on the company, as well as if you happen to have any issues with any of your brushes within that six-month um, warranty period. So here are all of the brushes. Again, you guys, I'm going to have to go off camera and take these out of the plastic, and then I will go through the brushes with you.
All right, you guys, so quickly, I do want to point out, if you, again, are traveling a lot or what have you, and or you just take your brushes on the go with you a lot, I would suggest putting these around your larger brushes just to keep them protected and keep the shape around them. I'm actually keeping these because I always have brushes in my bag. <laughs> All right, guys, so starting out, these, again, do have the Jess Up logo as well as the number of the brush on them. So again, really, really soft, luxurious feeling. Girl, these are so nice. Um, I just, it's been so long since I've had these, it feels like, and so I'm like, wow. Again, really, really nice. You are getting synthetic as well as natural. And as someone who lives on a goat farm and raises goats, before I go through this set, I want to put it out there. As far as I know, unless these people that sell the goat hair to make the goat brushes are completely brutal and nasty, goats are not harmed in the making of this. Basically what happens is when they go to be slaughtered for whether they're going to be slaughtered for meat and what have you or just, you know, it's hard for me to talk about because my goats are my babies. <laughs> But it does not hurt them to use their hair to make brushes. So, I mean, it's just as simple as cutting their hair. So, I just want to put that out there. Um, that way you guys don't think I'm creepy because I do use natural hair, goat hair brushes. It's <laughs> Anyway, back to it. So, you are getting, in this one, a 25-piece set. And for your face, you are getting all of these brushes. So, you are getting a... Lux Super Cheek Brush. This is the number 172. Put this back in there. You are getting the Face Shaper Brush, number 110. This would be a great brush to contour with or even set your under eyes. Uh, you could set your concealer with this. This one is the number 122 Petite, number 122 Petite Stippling Brush. I love a good stippling brush. They're amazing. So this is the 106 powder brush. Here we have another powder brush. This is the 101 Lux Face Definer. This would be amazing for bronzer, like, because of the tip. Oof. Y'all can tell I'm excited. <laughs> this one is the number 105 Lux Highlight Brush. And then we have the 109 Lux Face Paint Brush. So this is to use with creams and stuff. Actually, I might use this for face mask. That would be really nice for that. All right, uh, number 125 stippling brush. I love these, especially because I'm heavy handed when it comes to applying uh, cheek products, whether it's my bronzer, my contour, my blush, etc. <laughs> like, these are great for that. This is the number 103 defined buffer. And then we have the 104 Buffer. So really good for applying foundations, cream products, etc. I love this pink, you guys, against the silver. Now I do know and can tell you that the pink does cost a bit more. Um, so they do have a black and silver set. It's gorgeous. Just as gorgeous as this one. All right, guys. So then you also get all of these eye brushes. And basically every eye brush that is in this set is the same one from the 15 piece set. So I am not going to go through all these again and keep you guys here longer. I just want to show you that they are exactly the same, just a different color. So now I know that the question is going to arise. How much did Tasha spend on these brushes? <laughs> Honestly, you guys, I spent less than a hundred dollars. It was $66 and a couple cents, I believe. It was $66 and some change. Um, I did get 55 brushes in total, so it wound up costing $1.20 per brush. Now, I was looking at Sigma. I was looking at MAC. I was going to completely upgrade my brush collection, um, starting with like a master set and... I was looking at some pretty hefty price tags and I was like, I can't do it. So I, I ran across the Just Up brands and I remembered that I had had a brush set from them before um, and I enjoyed it. So again, you don't have to spend a ton of money on eye brushes. You just have to find those ones that are good quality 
that are kind of perform like professional brushes. So I know the next question is gonna be, well, you said I don't need them all, what do you recommend? If you are someone who is just looking to add to your brush collection and um, you're like intermediate to advanced in makeup, girl, get you the 25 piece set. You know, these are really, really nice to add to your collection. They're very, very pretty. Or even the other brand that I just showed you that came in the black pouch, you could do that one. Um, but for a beginner, I would say this would be good for you as well if this is your first brush set. Um, I know a lot of people still apply with their fingers and use the little applicators and stuff that come with the eyeshadow. Girl, you can't blend with that. Now, fingers, you can blend with that. But if you are looking to really up your eyeshadow game and your uh, facial products game, girl, get you some good brushes. These are very inexpensive. They are under $30. You're getting 25 pieces. The pink set is not under $30. <laughs> So, but if you're looking at just getting the black and silver set, I'm pretty sure that one is under $30. Again, I will link everything down below that will take you to my Amazon store if you wish to shop through that. Basically, if you shop through my Amazon store, you guys, you are supporting my channel as I do earn a small commission. It is free to you to use my link if you are uncomfortable with that. I completely understand. And I never want you to feel obligated using any of my affiliate links down below. So I will also link the direct links to this stuff for you guys. Um, so again, all the information down in the description box. If you guys have any questions, please reach out and let's chat about it. You guys know I love hearing from you. I love hearing what you bought based off my recommendations. And of course, I love hearing how you are enjoying the products. That is it for today's video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. And I hope that you guys are having an amazing day wherever you are. I look forward to chatting with all of you here in a little bit. I will be online later this evening to catch up with you guys. Thank you. Thank you guys so, so much from the bottom of my heart for spending time out of your busy day to come hang out with me. I really, truly appreciate it. To those of you who are new, what's up? My name is Tosh. I hope that before you leave today, you will consider hitting that subscribe button as well as the bell notification so that you are notified each time I upload, which is three times a week. I love you guys so, so much for all of your love and support, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.